We did it for you. Here's what you need to know with Amy and Sean on 1027 VGS. All right, today's the day. Las Vegas' very first professional sports victory parade going down the Las Vegas Strip, at least a part of it. Uh, today at 530, it kicks off. Parade route starts at Caesars Palace. It heads south on Las Vegas Boulevard in front of the Bellagio Fountains where they're going to take the stage. Dignitaries will be there. In-game entertainment will be there. Uh, should be a lot of fun. There's going to be closures yeah. around that uh, that intersection as well. Um, we have a story on our website, 1027VGS.com, if you want to find out the best places to park to be able to make it there and make it out as mm -hmm. well. Yeah. It's a be lot of people house. are also saying if you wanted to be by the stage to park at TI, it's free parking. You just walk Ooh, down the street. Walk. Not, I mean, I'm a lazy boy. <laughs> I, but you already said we were parking. I'm saying for people that will walk places. Nah, yeah, that's a that's a mile. That's about a mile, right? I don't think so. From Ti, Ti is is um, right there on the strip ish. I think it's close enough. Okay, the drive. Um, well, it doesn't say on the maps here. Hold on, I'm, I'm finding it right now because everything looks closer than it is. It is. It is one mile. Okay. It's a one mile. Have you walk. ever walked a mile before yes, it in your stinks. life? <laughs> Anyways, for those of you that are active in life, you can park at TI. It's free parking, and there's not gonna. It's not gonna be a pain getting out because you're not gonna be on the strip. You're gonna be off the strip. When my phone tells me I hit my step goal, I'm like, ugh. <laughs> oh <my God>. Why? <laughs> Uh, so, but here's the deal, though. Speaking of miles, a lot of people, at least on social, where everyone likes to complain, saying that the uh, route is just too short. It's an insult to the ladies. Now. Being in Boston for the first Patriots parade, that was a very small parade that first year, too. They had no idea what to expect. Yeah. It was a madhouse. The next year, things got a lot longer. Uh, that's what I'd say. If you are, if you think, you know what, that's not enough support, make sure you're down there. Make it big. Yeah. So next time, Clark County makes that a much longer parade, which yeah. would be great. So I'm going to certainly make my way down there. Uh, the Raiders game on Sunday. <laughs> R.I.P. Mm -hmm. Not a good game. Well, he's 16 and 0, uh, scoring in the uh, fourth quarter that let the Cardinals in for an overtime, and then they lost in OT. Yeah. And quarterback Kyler Murray of the Arizona Cardinals decided to run towards the Winfield Club seats and celebrate with a Cardinals fan after that victory. A uh, hand, though, appears out of nowhere. This was a video that was kind of just released uh, yesterday. It really, uh, you know, took took fire yesterday. Yeah. Uh, and it smacks Kyler right in the face. Kyler took umbrage to that, spotted a fan that he believed it was. It was a Raider fan. Uh, Metro is now investigating, mm -hmm. and they don't know who the person is. So I feel like they, they, they'll they probably, there's so many ways, there's so many cameras. Hopefully they, they find out who it is, because it's just like, just there's really no reason for it. There's a problem with having the fans that close to the action, mm -hmm. though. We're just so many dumb fans. Yeah, I know. <laughs> really I know. dumb, especially when they're all fed up on you know alcohol and mm -hmm. yeah, and, and on a loss. Uh, on a loss, yeah, the the loss really puts them over. Yeah. Finally, uh, being put over. Wow, uh, CCSD test scores improving. Thankfully, after the pandemic dip, yeah, they're heading in the right direction. Third through eighth graders took the assessment. It showed a 41.2% of CCSD students scoring proficient in English. That's up 4% from the year prior, right in the heat of the pandemic. 26.4% uh, proficient in math, just over 5% higher than the year before. Uh, not setting the world on fire. But, but up is good. Up is good. Up mm -hmm. better. Uh, for those of you who didn't know that, you're not proficient in math. <laughs>